Morning everybody. I had a recent question about the bed topper that you can buy from a uh, happier camper and whether or not it was worth it. It is a little expensive um, and is uh, buying an off market version a better option for you. So let's go check out what that looks like. One of the things I really like about the bed topper and is one of the reasons why I think it's worth getting the version from Happier Camper is that it rolls up into this bolster. So it, when you're not using it, if you don't want to leave it down, it just uh, it facilitates like being able to lounge in this space a little bit better, I think. Um, but let me show you how these are held together. So here's the bed topper and the way you're gonna release this is by pulling back the Velcro. Now it's pretty tight. You can see how nicely tight it's rolled up. And honestly, it takes two of us to get it looking just so. <laughs> uh, but let me unroll the whole thing for you. One of the things that I like about the bed topper as well is that the Velcro that you use to roll it up and secure it is also how you create a kind of seamless um, connection between the two pieces so that when you put your sheet on top of this, it feels a little more uh, connected. So you don't worry about one piece shifting underneath you and the other not moving with it. So yeah. That looks pretty good to me. Michael, <laughs> the reason you're here is I need your help uh, running a little test. Okay. Okay. So <clears throat> we want, we have a request from someone to help them to figure out if they're going to get the topper. They want to know if you sink into the topper or is it softly supportive? Yeah. So I need you to be my fan of white and help me with this little experiment. I'm a fan of white hair. Yeah, are you ready? Okay. Thank you for this. <laughs> You're the best husband ever. <laughs> okay, husband, do you feel uh, that you're sinking into the topper or is it softly supportive? Hmm. I feel slightly more softly supportive underneath than sinking in. You don't look like you're sinking in, in. If I push my hand in, yeah. it kind of sinks, but it comes back up. But I think sinking in would be more like if I was lying on one of these pillows. It would be mushy. I'd be sinking into the pillow. But yeah. as it is, um, softly supportive. All right. Um, this is very subjective, but I appreciate you <laughs> playing along to yeah, help this person I out. I might take a nap, actually. It's <laughs> softly supportive. <laughs> okay. Nice, indeed. Okay, Facebook person. There's your answer. It's softly supportive. And uh, yeah, it's super comfortable. But the real question is, should you buy it from Happier Camper or should you buy it off market? And I don't know. I mean, it's such a personal question. It all depends on what's important to you. For us, the sense that it feels integrated, it's the same uh, material as the, the cube covers. Um, the fact that the Velcro wraps it up into a bolster and then you can use that to keep the pieces together. That stuff matters to us. And so since I'm not super crafty, um, I'm not gonna be pulling out my sewing machine and creating one myself. So um, we uh, are happy that we bought ours through Happier Camper. But maybe that's not the right decision for you. Only you can tell. But at least now you have a little more information to make that decision with. And so like and subscribe. Maybe we'll figure out some more information that you find helpful. And you'll get alerted when I post the video. I hope everybody's staying well and healthy. And uh, post some comments below and let me know if there are any other topics uh, that you'd like to learn more about. And we'll do our best to get my husband to be my Vanna White. And we will show you. Take care, everyone.